Hi all, today we are going to Ibadan by train. I am so excited. So we just arrived, it's about 7 in the morning now. The train departs at 8. And we just went in here, yeah, in here to buy the tickets. And then you walk out and there we enter the waiting area. So let's go. So here's where you come out after you bought your tickets, the ticket hall. And now we are going here through security. And the train is already down there. So let's go. <laughs> I think so. Shops, exit, we have to go that way. So we just used the lift, but uh, here is where you will come up. And then... To the waiting area. and is taking us to a part of the last season. And that's where we're station at IGG. These will enable some passing the store. Johnson Station at Alagomeji Lagos and next stop is at we will be stopping for five minutes to enable some passengers to board the train. Items that are not allowed on legal Sibata train service include luggage above 25 kg, compressible materials, perishable or sustainable items, life or dead animals, arm, sharp object, pornographic materials, smoking or consumption of alcohol, motorcycle or bicycle. Ladies and gentlemen, please be informed now that we have some caterers on board and these are the menu we have. We have jollof rice and chicken, we have meat pie, we have donuts, we have sausage, we have coffee, we have soft drinks and we also have water. Please moving around the cabin is not allowed. Please you can signify the creatures on board, please you can just signify they will meet you and you just deliver your what you want for them they will give it to you. Please be informed also that we now have a nurse on dogs to attend to medical issues. Thank 
passengers, remember to take your luggage when exiting. You can make your exit through each of the coach. Please, remember to take your luggage when exiting. Thank you. We had just arrived, the journey was smooth, we are now going to the resort just to check in already I guess check in is three but we're just going there now so let's see Good morning. Look at that. Oh, wow. I'm alone. Oh, no. What's that? We just checked into our apartment. We are staying at the, in the one bedroom flatlet. Okay, we are in the one bedroom flatlet. Okay, let me show you around where all the apartments are. This is big tree here. here. Anyway, let's enter the apartment, the living area. Here you can enjoy a nice meal. The kitchen here, simple. Everything looks very, very clean and simple. Very nice, just simple style. So I'm very pleased to see that. Also the place smells very fresh. You know, when you come in, like it doesn't smell stuffy. It just uh, smells very nice. Here is our bedroom. There you have it. How cute is this? I love the bed frame. And there is a photo of a tree. Would that be the tree from outside? <laughs> I think look how beautiful this is. I love this so much. That is such a nice touch. In our own apartments, we do a throw blanket. But this is also very nice. Okay, the change the linen between guests. If you feel like you need your bed sheets and towels washed daily, please leave this card on your pillow. And what is this? Okay, they're doing some refurbishment work, so they just want to let us know. Nice. Here you have a desk in case you want to do some work, I guess. Here, the bathroom. Oh, look at these tiles, so funny. Simple, okay, a shower head up there. No handheld shower, unfortunately. And for the rest, yeah, this bathroom is clean. I can do 
maybe they are going to refurbish this as well because it kind of looks like it's about time but um, this towel is for your shoes and then here we have a lovely balcony like oh my god it's absolutely stunning and then we saw that they have this really nice um, I don't even know what these things are called but you can just open and close them do you see that so you can still enjoy the natural breeze and it has like a mosquito net so that's really nice hello and you have a little tv there but yeah who is going to use that so that is it i am very excited to be here we're now just going to relax before we we'll step out again Hello? Yeah. Okay. It's okay, I will do it. Check out the swimming pool here. Actually, quite big. And here is like an area. So the reception is down there, and here is where you can come out to sit down, have some food. There is a barbecue place here, I guess tonight or in the evenings, maybe they will do some suya or whatever, grilled chicken. Here there is a playground, we will go there tomorrow because we just want to go for a walk now, not really to the playground. 
And here you have a tennis court. Yeah, so today, as you've seen, we just came this morning. They were nice enough to let us check in immediately as we were coming from the train station because original check-in time is 3 p.m. but we arrived here like what like maybe like 12 or so so we could just check in immediately so that was nice after that we went to the Amala Sky we did take away because she is a little bit tired so cranky so instead of eating there we did take away it was very nice very spicy though but nice so now we just came out, it's about 4, four o'clock now and we just came out for a walk and we want to see the lake down there or we think it's down there, we still have to find the place Snack bar and then you can sit here And there's the suya place, the grill place. Look how beautiful this is. Yeah, but that's what I was thinking, yeah. That people live here. Oh, you think they work here? Oh, look at the squirrels. Okay, you see the squirrels here. Wow, it's so beautiful here. And somehow this kind of road reminds me of the US and of the way the houses are as well. If that makes any sense, I don't know. Just a different feel. Okay, up there, I think. Oh yeah, you see this is a residential area. Interesting. Sure. Look how peaceful this is. And is there like a, a sort of an estate generator or whatever? <laughs> or like a generator for the whole complex? Or, or do they have maybe like solar panels maybe somewhere? Solar panels are the only generating system. Generating system. Yeah. Is that nice? Maize? Corn? This is cassava? Oh my god. Look at those, look at those hills down there. I would we call that mountains already? That's a hill. Okay, what is the difference? What defines like the what height of a mountain? <laughs> <laughs> so why would you, wouldn't you say that the mountains in this part of the country actually? I don't know, we have to check Google. What is over there? Where? Okay. Oh yeah. 
so apparently this is cassava which I didn't know that it looked like that the plants and then here is corn look at this look at this oh beautiful It is so quiet here, <laughs> like coming from Lagos, it is actually the quietness, the calmness of this place that is then overwhelming, does that make sense? I'm coming. So beautiful. I cannot even process what I'm seeing, <laughs> to be honest with you. Oh, those big trees that have been here for how many years? Mm -hmm. And what do you think this is? Okay. Yeah, they know these crops, these uh, whatever they planted here. Yeah. Oh, yeah? Oh, you stick them like that. Ah. Pollen, eh? No, this one looks like fed out of insect. Oh yeah, I saw yeah. Yeah, I saw the big insects. They look mm. like almost like giant termites. Mm. Oh they coming it's coming from the tree though. Maybe they're in there. I see the birds. Look, you see the birds disturbing them. The birds? Disturbing the, the insects. Swarm of insects there. Can you see it down there? It's like a swarm of insects, and the birds are eating them. Anyway, oh, look, them. it's actually yum, as you said. Yes, yum, yes. yeah. Planting date, uh, what is he even saying though? 9 21 5 to uh, let's say the 21st of may i wonder so that is four months ago oh my god there are the mosquitoes here anyway let me know if you know how long it takes for yam to grow There are mosquitoes here. They are here. But I used my uh, what's it called? Because I already knew that we would meet the mosquitoes in such a green area like that. So I used my. I told you about this before. And I actually picked up some more just now when we were in the town. So we are protected. Oh my god, what is that? Oh my god, those are the ones I don't like. Run! <laughs> it, it's funny, right? It seems like... It seems like, you know, coming from Europe, the insects here already seem... Well, they already are bigger and... or Not, not all of them are bigger, but they're different here, you know. <laughs> because of the like the more the tropical environment but coming out here i've seen ants that were like the size of a i don't even know a cockroach or something <laughs> okay we've reached a lake but is this the lake i don't know Yeah, you can fish. Yeah. It's 
so I don't know if you can see read this oh my god birds I didn't bring my sun hat. I don't want to burn up like that. You don't. Oh, you will get that in Yeah. We already came to the conclusion that. The people here are more <laughs> mellow, polite, even though I, I, to me Nigerians are already kind of like polite. I'm sorry, I, I mean coming from, um, how would you say that, like just as in greeting each other or saying or helping, compared mm. to, compared to, okay, friendly, friendly is the word. Okay, yes. Friendly, but here is different. But it was so hot. Like when we left the apartment, it was kind of like cloudy, I would say, right? Yeah. So I didn't even bring out my sun hat. So we're now going back. We've seen the lake. I would like to go back tomorrow. Anyway, look at this tree. I wonder why this tree is like just there by. Why didn't they remove that particular tree? Because everything else is just cleared. That looks like a baobab tree, right? Eh? A what? Baobab. Baobab? Okay. okay. What are those birds? I don't know. Where are they on the We It is now around six each. Look how nice it is here. I'm still trying to figure out what insects make these noise, make these sounds. I don't know. Is it? I have no idea. If you know, <laughs> let me know in the comments. Anyway, we are just coming back to that snack bar place now. We're just going to have something to eat and relax. now about eight o'clock we've been up for some hours now just sitting outside here so nice and quiet here only thing you hear is like these insects which I st still don't know what kind of insect it is. I thought it was crickets, but then I, I, when I looked up online, it said crickets are not really in Nigeria like that. And if they are, it's like during dry season. I don't know if that's correct, but it's wet, it's rainy season now. So I don't know if you know what these are, like in the evening and the night, in the evening and during the night, it was like they were really loud. So I wonder what they are. And then besides the, in the these kind of insects, you can hear the birds, 
just like so nice I cannot even describe how good this feels to be here <laughs> so we're now going to the main restaurant I would say where they serve breakfast it's a very short walk from our apartment it's just there so here's the bar where we were yesterday and then we go inside here that is the tennis court there this is just so I believe there are like these apartment blocks here and I think they have some down there as well yes, that would be nice with Ibom Air. Okay. Fly to New York this weekend. Okay. Mm. Yeah, that would be nice. How long will the flight be? Like two hours or so? Good morning. Yes. <laughs> oh, okay. When we were walking down here. Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> hey. All right. Oh, it's still so nice now. From seven to nine. Really? Yeah. It is raining a bit, but hopefully it will still be hot and sunny later. There's the poolside. Have like a, they have like a kitty playground here as well. But we're now standing oh, under this. Oh. Uh, we are now stand, standing under this. How would we call this? S uh, like a straw, like a. What is this? A bush hut. A bush hut? <laughs> a straw yeah. parasol? But I don't know because it's really Daddy. 
Oh, yeah, it's raining. Mm. Uh, uh, uh. We just came back from the breakfast. It is raining now, unfortunately, but hopefully it will clear up later. The breakfast was really, really nice, really tasty. I tried to show you uh, what they had, but we got there by nine and apparently the breakfast is served between seven and nine. By the time we got there, uh, they didn't, you know, some things were already gone. And I really like the accommodation, but I feel like there are a few things they should pay a bit more attention to. For example, I was looking for cutlery and uh, this was all that I found and then there was a sad looking frying pan there and when I tried to call the reception the phone was not working at all also they don't really give you a uh, body soap like shower gel they give this small bars and I had to request for more because they only gave one and the same for towels they only gave one small and one big towel and I feel like for three people two nights that is just not enough so i went over to the reception to ask for everything and they did give anything i asked for so that was really nice but another thing was they don't give any dishwash uh liquid and also no sponges no tea towel no nothing so when i asked for that this is what she gave me uh so I, I, it seems like they don't really give these things to guests usually i guess I understand it's not easy running a short lead business, but I think that these should be the basic things to give guests. Anyway, for you as a guest, then you know that maybe if you want to do a lot of cooking or whatever and you're coming by car, that you should perhaps take your own pots and take your own <laughs> things that you need because you cannot assume that uh, you will find them there in the accommodation. For the rest, the experience was really good and the staff is extremely friendly. Okay, it stopped raining now. I, it's, I don't even know. I feel kind of sleepy because we were just inside. I think it's about 12 now and we're going to the golf course. Golf course is over here. Should have worn my shoes it's just been raining and i don't know what i was thinking though but All right, so they are doing the uh, golf thingy there. Can you see it there? <laughs> uh, but there is another lake down here. So we are going to check out what that looks like. Where we were walking before, the grass was really long. And there are so many insects here, you have to come with your mosquito repellent or whatever. I keep saying it, but it's true though. Look how nice it is here. And over there, I don't know if you can see it, 
where you can actually see the town can you see the houses up there wow seems to be a busy road there so. uh, I can see the forest there again I think you can perhaps like go all the way around that lake that we went to yesterday I feel like well it's really really far maybe it doesn't connect but it looks like the same forest we saw but of course this this land is just really big so I don't, I'm not sure it's kind of starting to rain again Come this way. What is your hair bunch? What is it now? What happened? A <laughs> mosquito. So we made it back. Our apartments are behind us. So this is the golf course. I guess the clubhouse down there. And then they also have a basketball court there. And we just came from there.